What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Tags. You already know what's up. Today, I wanted to show you something quick and very useful, right? So what we're going to show you is how to convert a Binance coin to a Ethereum token, right? So if you got a BEP20 token, I'm going to show you how to convert that to ERC20 token or vice versa, right? So let's get right into it. So, first thing you want to do is go to this link, binance.org backslash bridge. I'll link it in the description below, right? Once you do that, you want to connect to the wallet. So, you want to connect to MetaMask wallet. So, right, boom, connect MetaMask wallet. Put in your code. What account do you want to go to? See, I want to actually connect a different account. Hold up. Hold up. I'm trying to connect my Binance. Let me connect to the current wallet that they want me to connect to. So once I'm on MetaMask, I want to click on Ethereum Mainnet. And I want to go down to my smart chain. If you don't know how to add Binance to your MetaMask, I've got another video to teach you that. That link will also be in the description, okay? All right. So now that we connected to the, the, meta, the, the MetaMask, what you want to do is send yourself that, that Binance. And you see, I got USDT. So here's what we're going to do first, right? Because I got USDT in Binance token. That's my example. Is I just converted money here. So as you can see, I've got a total of a thousand and well technically a total of a thousand and seventy usdt so what we're going to do is send that over to here we're going to add a token token address well i don't know it so how do i find it i'm hey, going to go to my here? favorite i'm going to go to my favorite thing dextools.io right hit up dextools click on the binance tab then we're going to look up USDT. Boom. Now we know exactly what it is. This says Dido. This does not say Binance. I'm confused. You know what? I got an even better solution. Just to be certain, go to your wallet, pull up your address on the BSC scan, right? When you go to the BSC scan, you can see all of your tokens right here, bong, and the value for it. So, Binance pegged USD, bong. I want to click on that token. Once I click there, click on the contract. Now, click on token tracker, Binance pegged USD. This is what you're looking for. Once you're here, click on the contract and click copy address once you copy that address we're gonna go right back to metamask wallet open that right back up and we're gonna add that token right the custom address boom automatically inputted usdt for you right next now you got the the the, the token added Yes, I want to add these tokens. Let's swap. Oh, nope, 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 my fault. I didn't mean to click swap. I meant to click receive. Where's my receive? Where's my receive at? You account at BSC scan just want to be double sure of what's going on here this is my address copy that address boom so now I'm gonna go back to trust wallet all we did was add USDT token to my MetaMask right why do we do that because we need MetaMask to start swapping so boom here we go my USDT is not on the map USDT talk to me make sure it's the Binance pegged one boom done bow rescind my fault we want to send this bread out 
recipient address pasted amount max send it's going to cost you 12 cents i say that eat that bar so me boom bow parao so i sent the bread over it should take about 25 seconds who knows let's go back to metamask see what it say they might be like hello you're here we're gonna see what's up oh here we go action and we're in there right 1070 usdt so now what do we want to do we want to connect the wallet is the wallet connected yes it is so now we gonna make sure say usdt because that's what we put in there we want to switch that to the ethereum network right right from binance chain network to ethereum network what asset are we switching usdt so we're literally converting the binance usdt to the ethereum usdt why am i doing this because i may try and go to a platform that doesn't accept the binance version of the usdt but they might accept the ethereum version of it right so that's why i'm switching over so let's go ahead and do that if you have not added binance smart chain network in your metamask please click add network and continue did i not add that i'm clearly sure i clicked add that okay max amount i want to convert the max amount my max amount should be 1070 all right if that's correct my max amount should be 1070 your swap address will be receiving the address your swap address will be your receiving address please switch the network to check your balance after completion what is my swap address i don't even know but guys hopefully destination how does it know where it's going you know what i'm gonna trust the process i can't change this destination i'm gonna trust the process so let's go ahead we're learning together if i lose my money oh my god you know what guys let's be let's be smart about this we're gonna start with maybe like 20 bucks just to see what happens and then we'll go with the whole amount fuck the bulls oh you can only start with 110 okay We'll start with 110 and then we'll go the full amount. We'll see what happens. If I see this go into my Ethereum account, then we're gonna send the full amount and I showed you how it works. Cause I'm telling you, we're learning together. I just Googled this and said, all right, let's try it. Please transfer through your wallet to avoid loss. Okay, submit. Transfer USD to Binance Smart Chain. Submit transaction to Binance Smart Chain. Yes, submit. Alert, insufficient funds. What's the funds? What are you trying to charge me? I need Ethereum in my account? Oh, Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, man. I need a thick guys. I've got no Ethereum in my account. We got to load up the Ethereum account now to make this work. So we're going to go back to Ethereum mainnet. Wait, I got $12. How much they trying to charge the God? Oh, bruh. This shit crazy. Yo, how much are they trying to charge me? Okay. Can I even, do I even have Ethereum in this account? I got a little bit of, look, I got a little bit of Ethereum. I'm going to. I'm gonna send myself. No, I don't wanna buy Ethereum. Okay, so Meta, I don't use MetaMask clearly. So when you want your address, you just click on account and it's gonna send whatever assets, I guess. So look, I'm gonna send myself just slight a minute, a little bit. Just a, I keep clicking receive, just a little bit. Paste that address, how much? Shit, I don't even know how much it is in 0 .002, huh? how much is that even worth? Can I click this? Oh, USD value. All right, we're going to send ourselves 50 bucks. 97 cents to send that. Let's do it. Boom, bow, action. Get some water. Yo, if you don't know about this, Namazi. I called it Namaste earlier today. Namazi. 
This stuff right here tastes like quality. All right, Brody, I'll catch you later, man. Oh, don't do that, bro. God, where's my food at? They playing. He's on the way six minutes ago. My food. Oh. Nah, I just ordered some pancakes. That's it. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. I'm still recording. Let me get back into this mood. Hold on. Where was I at? Tags? Yeah. Yeah. That sounds like it's finally nice to meet you. Yeah. Okay, boom. So I don't know what I was doing. I was sending myself Ethereum. So let's check the MetaMask wallet. Did we get the Ethereum back? We did. We had 60 bucks. Okay, we're going to retry this transaction. So it says the receiving address is XYZ. Let me open up my MetaMask and let's, let's, let's accept that. We're going we gonna to send the, we gonna send the whole thing because obviously it connected and it knew what I wanted. So I'm going to send the whole thing. Max amount, 1070. Right? I want to swap BNB in this order. Nah, I don't want to swap BNB. I want to swap USDT. Oh, you see, I see what's going on. Bang. I got to switch networks. Switch networks on them. Switch networks on them. Hey, smart chain, smart chain. Okay, okay. Boom. Max, 1070. Boom. Look at how easy that is, how it works. Okay. Look, I'm sorry that this video isn't as smooth as my other ones. Like I said, I just Googled it. I've never used this, this program, this, this website before. We testing it out together. Next. I want to trade again. I'm just double checking because I don't want to lose any money. I'm trading USDT as the asset from Binance to Ethereum. So now my USDT is BEP20 USDT is going to turn into an ERC20 USDT. Okay, next. A network fee of $10. So keep in mind, you're going to be paying around 10 bucks to use this service. Okay. Confirm. Submit MetaMask transaction. It automatically popped up my MetaMask. I like that. It's still telling me I don't have enough funds. Like, bruh. Yes, I do. Or does it want... I'm confused. What is it asking me for? This ain't good, this ain't good. I just loaded this motherfucker up. What is it asking me for, bruh? Let me try and let me let me send myself some Binance chain. Let me see what happens. Let me see what happens. If I buy myself some Binance chain, I'm going to send myself. I don't even think I have Binance chain. I just used it all to switch to USDT. Okay, I do got some Binance chain. Send. I'm going to send myself a little bit more. Just, just to be, I mean, we're going to see. Ready? Send myself. It was a $10 fee, let me send 12 bucks. We're gonna try this again. Third time's the charm, guys, you feel me? We gotta stay positive. That's just how you gotta go about life, man. Let's go, third time's the charm, lucky number three. 
okay? Let's go back to the MetaMask wallet. Let's try this again, okay? We not playing. This ain't a game. Waiting for deposit. Look at this, waiting for deposit. I don't know what deposit they waiting on. We're gonna try it again. We confirming $10 fee. Submit MetaMask transaction. We in business, baby. I got enough for it. I needed the Binance coins, not the Ethereum coins. Okay, you see what I'm saying? Look, you just got third times the charm. What I say? Confirm transaction is gonna send me my bread from USDT to a new USDT. Let's confirm. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. It's doing this thing. You see the little loading bar right there? It's doing this thing. It's doing this thing. Oh, baby. I don't know if I'm going to cut this video down because I want to show you guys my mistakes. You know what I mean? Trial and error. That's the point of learning together. You got to make your mistakes. You're going to make them with me. Confirmation is pending. Three out of 15. Pending. I think we did it, baby. It costs 10 bucks, but you know what? If it's gonna if it's gonna transfer there hassle free, I mean like I said I didn't know what I was doing now I know what I'm doing it's gonna be mm, 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 go. I think that's worth ten bucks the convenience you feel me it's worth that. But um, you feel me? We gonna see how many transactions I wonder. I could click on the transaction ID boom I could see success so actually I should be able to just see the funds. And my MetaMask wallet since it's success, right? Minus 1070 USD, gone, right? Okay, let's open up my Ethereum mainnet wallet, right? Assets. I got to add a token. So, again, we're going to go to my trusty USDT. Go, go to Dex Tools. Go to Launch App. Click on Ethereum. USDT. Yep, you know what? You know what the vibes are. Transaction ID is there. I can just click the transaction ID, and it's going to give me everything I need to know. MetaMask wallet. It's going to give me the transaction ID. Let me go back to uh, Smart Chain. You feel me? We're not playing games. Copy this address. Go to the BSC scan. Oh, you know what? I got an even better idea. Go to etherscan.io, right? This is why we learning together. I'm teaching you how to find your funds when it doesn't pop up in your wallet. We're going to etherscan.io. You want to go to MetaMask. Go to your Ethereum mainnet, and you want to copy that account, right? Click. Once it's copied, paste it in the Ethereum Explorer. And it's going to find your account. And again, you see Ether value, $62 at 1930 That's because it has more than just that $62, right? I just have $62 worth of Ether. So now look at ERC20 token transactions. Okay. 44 seconds ago, we got this one for Tether USDT. Why did I click Tether USDT? Because it's going to give me their actual information for the ERC20 token of Tether. I want to copy this address. I want to go back to my MetaMask. And then I want to go to Add Token because you see I'm in Ethereum mainnet now. I'm on my Ethereum wallet. So I want to click Add Token. You can search. Actually, you could just search USDT. Boom. Perfect. Next. And my balance pops up once I searched it. Add tokens. Boom. My money is there. Look at that, guys. My money is there. Easy. Easy. So that's how you use 
this website to transfer a, a BEP20 token to a, an ERC20 token or vice versa. So if you have an Ethereum token that also can be on Binance, that's how you swap them. Um, yeah, till next time I'll catch you. Peace.